Hi dear students, here is a question from gate uh, 2021 in the afternoon session which is related to CSE department and the question came from linear algebra. So now let us look at the question. The question is, suppose that P is a 4 by 4 matrix, okay, it is a 4 by 4 matrix such that every solution of the equations px p into x is equal to null matrix. So this is system of homogeneous equations, matrix notation. So for the system of homogeneous equations, every solution should be of the format scalar multiple of this matrix, every solution. Then the what is the rank of p? What is the rank of p? Actually, you look at here, the system of linear equations are given as p into x is equal to null matrix but p is of order 4 by 5 p is of order 4 by 5 means what there will be 4 rows that means p is of the form 4 rows and 5 columns 1 2 3 4 4 rows and particularly 5 columns 1 2 3 4 5 so 4 rows 5 columns total how many entries 20 entries so since indirectly what can i say is since there are 4 rows therefore 4 equations equations are how many equations are 4 and how many columns? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 5 columns. Therefore, unknowns. Number of unknowns. Number of unknowns. How many? Number of unknowns are 5. So, the variables are 5. Equations are 4. That means, every equation uh, look likes like this. For example, uh, x1 plus x2 uh, minus 3 x3 minus x4 plus x5 is equal to some 0. 0 only because these are homogeneous system of linear equations. Look at the first equation. How many unknowns are there? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 5 unknowns are there. That's what number of unknowns are 5. That means 5 variables. Okay. Likewise, how many equations? The number of equations are 4. Such kind of system of equations is given. But every solution is of the format. Some scalar multiple of this vector. That means every solution is of the form. So every solution is of the form let me write solution here so every solution should be of the form every solution is of the form some scalar multiple of that vector so it is uh, transpose is given transpose i am writing as a column vector so row vector transpose is column vector so 2 5 4 3 1 so this is the form of the solution is that lambda is a scalar so therefore total how many solutions like this now look at lambda is 1 so 1 into this vector that is the first solution lambda is half half into this vector so that is second solution similarly lambda is minus 1 lambda is 2 lambda is 3 lambda is 4 lambda is 5 likewise whatever the scalar number is substitute here so those will be the solutions to this system of linear homogeneous linear equation therefore how many solutions exist indirectly indirectly infinitely many solutions exist because lambda can be any number from real number system or uh, let us say for particular field so infinitely many solutions exist so this is the overview of the problem let us quickly enter into the solution <coughs> so before entering into this uh, solution we need to know this theorem the number of linearly independent solutions of system of homogeneous equations ax is equal to 0 is n minus r here r is the rank okay here r is the rank and n is number of unknowns so therefore total number of linear independent solutions are n minus r okay r is the rank of the given matrix coefficient matrix and n will be the number of unknowns okay so let me erase this to this yeah okay so now let us apply this theorem to attack this problem so what i want i want rank of this a here so indirectly rank of p here okay now look at so therefore number of linearly independent solutions look at this theorem number of linearly independent solutions linearly independent solutions is how how many is nothing but n minus r where n is the total number of unknowns and r is the rank okay so particularly for this problem i want rank i want therefore r is question mark here so r is question mark in this problem r is question mark so these two things we know we need to know then only we can find r value what is the number of unknowns here number of unknowns are how many just now explained number of unknowns are 5 so therefore number of unknowns are 5 r we don't know 
and uh, next i want linear linear point solutions are how many so what are the solutions particularly these are the solutions for different different values of lambdas okay so how many solutions exist infinitely many solutions exist okay in that for example if you substitute lambda is 1 what will get 1 into this vector 2 5 uh, 4 3 1 okay so this is one of the solutions among those infinite many solutions so therefore you multiply 1 into 2 2 so 2 5 4 3 1 okay this is first solution next if you want to find second solution then replace lambda value uh, let us write lambda is 2 for example so 2 into again same the vector 2 5 okay 2 5 4 3 1 4 3 1 let us take this 2 5 4 3 1 now simplify this what you will get 2 into 2 4 2 5 is a 10 2 4 is a 8 2 3 is a 6 2 1 is a 2 so this is second solution likewise we can generate the infinitely so infinitely many solutions now this is the first solution this is the first solution and this is the second solution similarly third solution let us take minus 3 or 4 or 1 by 2 whatever but what you observe all these uh, solutions in this infinitely many solutions how many linearly independent solutions exist independent solutions look at for example compare the first and the first and second solution how you are getting second solution by multiplying the first solution with 2 then only I am getting second solution therefore the second solution is depending on first solution so this is dependent solution this is dependent solution similarly if I find the the third solution uh, let us write minus 3 lambda is minus 3 minus 3 into 2 5 uh, 4 3 1 and then what I will get so 3 into uh, minus 3 into this one so minus 6 minus 15 minus 12 minus 9 minus 3 so we are getting this one indirectly from the first solution only simply by multiplying minus 3 so indirectly this solution is again uh, this solution is depending on again this solution so therefore this is dependent solution dependent solution so therefore independent solution is how many only first solution will be the independent solution therefore number of independent solutions are how many one only remaining all are dependent solution which are obtained from the first solution only so therefore total number of linear independent solution is one and the number of unknowns are five and rank win is supposed to calculate therefore r is question mark therefore finally r is equals to bring r to left hand side and one to right hand side so five minus one so now four therefore the given rank is uh, the obtained rank is four okay so therefore rank of this uh, uh, matrix caution matrix p is how much four so this is the answer